In some parts of our viewing area, roads are simply impassable. Definitely true, as we saw earlier in Ann Arbor. Jacqueline Francis live with a look at the conditions there. Jacqueline. It was about an hour ago. Our cell phones got that loud buzzing safety alert. If you're in Ann Arbor, you know what I'm talking about. It was the city putting out an alert saying don't go on the road driving. A lot of the streets are impassable. This is exhibit A. If you were streaming with us earlier, you'll remember that our live truck got stuck just on the other side of that downed wire. Actually, DTE has a crew right now. They just pulled up a few minutes ago on here checking on that wire. But the problem was is a lot of cars were getting stuck because you couldn't back up. The roads were too slippery. You couldn't go forward because of the wire. Just within the last hour, we saw a driver having to shovel his way out of that mess. He had the help of my photographer, Jake, who's on the other side of this street where there's a tree down as well. So you can just see either way, if it's not this, it's that not allowing cars to come through. This is just a little bit of what we've seen tonight. Thunder, snow, and flashing skies. Whether it be lightning or sparking power lines, Ann Arbor has it all. On the roads, cars spinning out and drivers stuck. We just saw a few people needing uh, some assistance, so uh, they said they're all right, but it didn't seem like they were. Good Samaritans so. like Hayden Neiman, who's new to Michigan. Complete opposite climate of Australia, that's for sure. Stepping in to help sort out the mess. So I decided to pull over and then uh, gave some suggestions which seemed to help out. Instead of trying to push them up the hill, I just told them to uh, push the front of the car around and spin around and we got them out of there and they're all on their way home. At home, families left hoping the lights will stay on, especially after last week's ice storm. 60,000 people losing power in Washtenaw County alone. This storm bringing its own set of challenges. A downed power line in the road surrounded by fallen branches, causing this street to close for the night. We'll end on some good news. The lights are on here. No power is out and DT is on the scene for that line. So some positives there. I'll send it back to you in the studio. It is all right, uh, Jack.